Well, after Alabama's big win over Clemson back in August, the Crimson Tide donned the cover of Sports Illustrated. I have a copy right here. It says, SEC beware. Alabama sends an early warning, and they sent the SEC another warning on Saturday as they go into Fayetteville, Arkansas, and beat the Arkansas Razorbacks 49-14. to The Crimson Tide rolled up over 300 yards rushing, including long touchdown runs by Glenn Coffey and Roy Upchurch. Coach Saban and the players said that they were pleased by the performance, but they also said there's a lot that needs to be improved on. There's a significant amount of things that you know, we probably need to improve on, and I think technically you know, you'd like for the players to look at the game from the standpoint of uh, how did we execute, what do we, what do, we do, what, what do we need to do to get better at certain things in our game so that we can improve as a team. Uh, and certainly, you know, that's what we want our focus to be, and uh, I think our players were good that way. The coach will always find some flaws in there somewhere, and I think that's what makes the team great. When you, when you try to, you know, eliminate as many mistakes as possible to where you're closer to perfect because no one's perfect. But the closer you get, the better you are, obviously. You know what I'm saying? So I think that's what we're trying to get. We didn't play as well as we wanted to last week either, uh, to the standards that we've set for our defense. And uh, we know that. It's a great win, but we got a long way to go, a lot of improvement to do. Um, so we're going to be going out there with that mindset today to, to fix the things we did wrong and make sure we don't do them again this weekend. It's definitely going to be stressed this week, you know, the little things of doing our technique right. If it's uh, corners, you know, getting your hands on the receivers, uh, safeties, you know, keying alignment on, on run pass face because there was definitely times where we came up a little bit on play action and then we should have been deeper in our drop. So technique is, is going to be stressed a lot this week and, uh, and I think tackling is going to be stressed a lot more too because there, there was some missed tackles Saturday that, uh, that if we just wrapped up, then it would have been down right there. There's a couple of things on offense that we can work on as far as the passing the ball, running the ball. I mean, we did a lot of great things. We also did a lot of bad things. It's up to us to go out there and change it. Well, the win on Saturday moved Alabama up to number eight in the AP polls this week, and that means it's going to be a top ten matchup on Saturday against number three Georgia between the hedges in Athens. Reporting from Tuscaloosa, I'm Brent Magnuson for Palestra.net, the College Network.